Xavier said, sorry for the late. I'm fully free from that one. I may be driving home, but smart car can do smart talk and wow. we're, we're good to go. Okay. That's a go for launch, Houston. Well, what? How are we supposed to? I thought we were supposed to get him on the camera. This uh, is live, folks. This is live. Uh, it's okay if he doesn't. If he, we can call. We can. I yeah. can call him, and if if he turns his camera off, that's fine too. Okay. But let's okay. let's try. Okay, should we try call Zayba? Should I try call him? Let's do it. Omg. <laughs> Will he pick up? Hello. Hey. hey. Hello. Hello. How is everything? Good. Can you hear the sound bites? Yeah, dude. I can hear the sound effects, yes. Awesome. Oh, okay. great. So you're driving right now, Xavier. Is that correct? Pardon? Are you driving right now? Yeah, I am driving. I'm just driving home from a family thing. Oh, nice. Oh, lovely. What was... Is it a close family member or was it a bit awkward? Bruh. Uh, it was... It was <laughs> it was a close family member, so uh, ah. no need for yes, yeah. Lovely, lovely. So Xavier, you're going away on holiday. And yes, I am going away on holiday. And you're going away for three and a half months. Three and a half months. That is correct. Right. Yes. So what, what? Why are you going away for so long? Well, the, there's a long answer and a short answer. Do you want the long answer? Sure. That's why we're here, man. All right. Well, yeah. I, was meant to do, I was meant to do an exchange in London uh, for my undergrad for three months. And then at the end of that three-month exchange, I would have a month in Italy to spend with my family and my friends before term started uh, following that. However, 2020 was the year that this was supposed to happen. Uh, and we all know what happened in 2020. Yeah. So uh, because of COVID, I went on to do a postgrad, And uh, since then, have yet to go back to visit my family and friends in Italy. So I'm making the most of the time that I have missed. I see. So, you, so, you're... so it's not an exchange. You're just going to... Well, I am studying for a little bit, but this is not an exchange, no. Wow. So you're studying. And where are you studying? So you're going to be studying at the... Yeah. So I'm going to I'm going to do a sh just completely... There's a very loud car. Um, That's I'm right. going <laughs> to... <laughs> I'm going to do... Because I've studied directing, right? I have a master's degree in film directing. I'm yeah. going to do a short acting course to, at one of the acting schools in London. So two week long acting course. Oh wow, that's awesome! Yeah. Um, just 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 to see the other side, uh, and then from there I'll go to Italy and spend the rest of the time in Italy. And what do you plan to do in Italy while you're there? Just like see family and stuff. Mostly, yeah, just catch up with family and friends and experience the culture. Get to speak the language properly, fully, nonstop. For, a couple of months that'll be really nice to remember back right back so we again we 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 have this idea I, I i we have this pitch where the idea is that we'd love you to now that now that you're calling to the show the idea yep. that now you can go away to europe and then if you want to vlog anything or film anything or put together a little thing you can then send it in and also you can call in to the show and keep us updated with your travels to Europe. I like the that idea. Idea. Yeah. idea. That's the yeah, idea. I think it's a brilliant idea. Yeah, I'd love to do that. If you're if you're down yeah. for that, obviously, you know. But yeah, no, for sure, for sure. Yeah. I mean, I know. Keep it's, me accountable. <laughs> it's yeah, of course. It's been a Xavier's been trying to come on the show now for a few years because you you've you uh, you asked back when we were doing the show in like. 2020 or something 2021 you've been asking for a while to come on and i i i, I appreciate the uh, the patience that you've had for us because we've been it's been hard like even even we struggle to get the show yeah yeah moving i think it's, sometimes um... it's even happening right now on the screen dan is <laughs> dan is completely fucking we ha i know we you had... can't see it savior but it's a mess you know yeah it's always a mess our I mean, cameras are all messed up 
But it's that's what we do. It's a that's we're, how we it's do early, it. It's folks. early days here. It's early days here. <laughs> I know you're not a vlogger, Xavier, but I'm expecting I'm expecting a bit of a vlog out of you if you don't mind. You get you you get you get you might get some you might get some vlogs. You will get some notable like bits of learning that I'll have. I'm I'm already coming up with a few ideas. Like so, if I ever learn anything while I'm away, you'll see that. Um, well, so who are you seeing? Like. Uh, uh, you don't have to say their names or anything, but like, how are they related to you? Like, is it grandparents? Is it aunties, uncles? What's the uh, so deal? So it's the it's the it's, so my my great aunt still lives in Italy, and the the children of my great grandparents on my grandmother's side are still there. So that's wow. the family. Um, and like the and the, the further descendants of that, so that there are people my age as well. Um, mm. and then, uh, and then all of the friends that I made while I was living there. So when I was eight years old, uh, we, the whole family moved to, to Italy, uh, and we lived there for three years and then we moved back. And so wow. for that time while I was there, I've made, I made some strong friends and I've kept in touch. So, yeah. Do you have any like uh, good Italian phrases for us? Anything we can use? Uh, uh, okay, that's you're putting me on the spot here. Um, I know, just like a like an easy <laughs> one, like like arrivederci or something like yeah, that. You know, dude. Or... <laughs> arrivederci is just yeah, good um, goodbye. So that's that's another way. It's the, another way of saying goodbye. It's like a, yeah, um, greeting in reverse. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Reading in reverse. That's a great, great way of putting it. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's, yeah. Let's see. G give me, give me a phrase and I'll translate it. That's much easier for me to do. Uh, what about like I'm going down the, the pub for a beer, you know? I drank beer with my friends. That mm, kind of thing. Like, yeah. I drank beer with my friends. How do you say that? Uh, okay. Um, ho bevuto una birra con miei amici. That sounds wow. great. That sounds like that sounds a lot proper than in, in English, you know, like I like how it sounds. That does sound more uh more appealing. Honestly. It sounds proper, you know, and I like that. Mm, mm. That's the best mm. part about I think <laughs> that the Italians, they had that uh you know, they get the food right, they got the They make it special. They and, make it And uh, Xavier, can I ask, are you um is there any chance of a maybe a uh a holiday romance on the cards or Ooh. <laughs> not that i'm planning to see anyone there for that no I, I mean like i mean i'm traveling alone so that means i'm traveling perfect alone. So we'll click, yeah i i, I can't i cannot yeah. uh, the, the political answer is i cannot confirm nor deny <laughs> will you say on the show if you um possibly encounter some kind of uh romance on holiday or if you're at least talking to someone would you be able to it would be it would be us? on a case-by-case -case basis Ooh, okay okay all right i think that's 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 a that's a gentleman answer I that's reasonable that. yeah very reasonable i respect that i mean there might be a childhood friend that you grew up with who now wants to have a bit of a holiday romance you never know Ooh. you never know <laughs> yeah i we'll see that's that's it's, it's still a long ways off. I've got to do a acting course first, so we'll think we'll think about that later. Well, I'm just curious as well. You're going to Italy. Are you do are you going to do any uh, like cooking courses or anything like that? I know that's a big thing to do while you're there. Um, no, not not really. I, I'm <laughs> I'm not I, like I'm not really a cook myself. So I see. My, you know, one of when when you I, I'm explaining this terribly. I have a younger brother. And typically, as families do, someone takes the role of the cook. And my out of me and my younger brother, my brother is the cook. So right. ah, yeah. okay, okay. Well, that's good. That's good. I mean, if you do a lot of eating on the holiday, then at least you're making the most of your trip. So you know. Yes. Yeah. Taste I'm, the good I'm food. Really looking, I'm really looking forward to the gelato uh, from my favorite gelateria. Yeah. Do you have a so, favorite Italian dish? Like pizza, pasta? What's the What's the best? Gnocchi. Gnocchi. Ah, okay. That's that's a good pick. Yeah, gnocchi is nice. Am I going dotty? Yeah. Yeah, I think you are. 